ladies and gentlemen. Good evening. This is the captain. Well, welcome to Ushuaia in Argentina. If you've been out and about and watching, you'll notice that the ship is now at anchor. The plan had been to go alongside. However, at this time, there's a, another ship on our pier. She was supposed to have sailed four hours ago, but uh, some very strong winds and they uh, are basically pinned onto the berth. So in order for us to go alongside, we have to wait for the Carnival Splendor to sail. Once she's sailed, then we'll obviously think about uh, how we get the Star Princess in and alongside. for you with this uh, sunny day <laughs> at least right now at least right now so meanwhile we leave the harbor um, let me tell you that we are Eduardo is the driver my name is uh, Susana I'm the guide I'm going to tell you some things about uh, Tierra del Museum um, is this uh, yellow building to the left side the one with a uh, glass window at the front that's the museum of the end of the world, the historical... Wow. Okay, and this is the Ushuaia Bay. Eh? Ushuaia Bay. It's eh? closed by this peninsula where is located the airport. Ushuaia is an uh, Indian name. The city has over 70,000 inhabitants, has grown up a lot in the last years, but most of the people that live here were not born here, me neither. We came from other places for different reasons. In my case, to work in tourism. I was born in uh, Buenos Aires, but I've been living here since 1992, 93. Uh, but the, the most of the people that came at the very beginning was because of a promotional law that was um, given in 1972, especially to develop economically the island, to populate it.
evening, this is the captain. Welcome back. Do hope you've had a wonderful stay here in Ushuaia. Weather today, for those of you ashore, has been very, very kind to us. Uh, beautiful sunshine. It's uh, almost inevitable that we get the occasional rain shower while here, but uh, once again, we've been very, luck very lucky. Well, we're just checking. There's a couple of people seemingly outstanding. Just trying to find their whereabouts. Unfortunately, however, I haven't got time to wait. So uh, if they're not here, we'll be on the way regardless. The good news for them, if they aren't here, is that at the moment, uh, very similar to yesterday for the Carnival Splendors, the wind is actually pinning us onto the quay at the moment. I'm just waiting for a lull in the weather. When the wind goes down, we'll uh, attempt to pull ourselves off the berth and be away from here. In the meantime, everything's ready. All our pre-departure checks have been satisfactorily completed and for all intents and purposes, we're ready for sea.